Hello, ladies and gents. Um, I'm John from WM Cutlery, and I wanted to do something of a kind of a short video on the ups and downs of knife making, um, and just kind of discuss, you know, my own personal observations of the uh, the art of knife making. Uh, knife making's been around for thousands of years that we know of, uh, and obviously today we have more modern equipment to speed things up, uh, get much cleaner, more accurate results uh, in the finished product. Um, but depending on your knowledge and tools and how far you want to take it, I suppose a combination of both, you uh, is going to determine how your product turns out and you can make a really nice product with not that many tools as an example um, but one knife making is tough to do in a sense that a knife or various types of knives or specific tools for uh, for cutting and uh, depending on what you're going to be using it for will have something to do with the design of the knife, the size of the knife, and so on and so forth. And these are things that I like to plan out as careful as I can on paper. I like to draw up and design knives and, and think about what I'm trying to end up with and what I'm going to use it for. And planning is always good and trying to get some kind of head start. There will occasionally be times when you're, as you're building any one knife, things will come up in the build that you have to solve uh, some mysteries and problems. And, and sometimes you just have to start completely over. But uh, stay patient. I know I have trouble with patience sometimes, but I, and I have things happen to me quite often with knives, but I always try to solve the problem, be prepared to have the problem, if I can sense that it's coming along, and, and, and uh, just keep moving forward and keep trying. Uh, this is for even some of the beginner knife makers. I've been making knives for a few years now, but uh, I know I'm not well known. I'm trying to kind of get known better, uh, get a a lot more customers and followers because I think it's taken me a little longer to kind of figure out what direction I wanted to go if I was going to stay with it. I think I now have some knives that I've made that I'm really proud of but I had to stick with it and so should you. If, you, if you're getting into this kind of business or kind of art for the first time and it is an art form, uh, give yourself a chance to find your place. That's the biggest thing. Make your knives that you like to make. Obviously, uh, there will be times where people will want to steer you a different direction. And I don't think it's out of uh, maliciousness or anything like that. Uh, I do occasionally get advice from people who don't make knives at all on how to make knives. And I have to just take it with a grain of salt. Uh, but keep moving forward. Keep trying. That's the best you're going to do. You're going to have to break a few eggs to make a good omelet. And it takes a little time. And uh, don't be afraid to put yourself out there making knives and your own designs. And being, uh, have faith in what you're doing and work hard at it. I'm John with WM Cutler. Thank you so much for your time.